It's a, it's a Hebrew phrase, tikkun olam, to repair the world. Morgan Elliott says her late mother, Northside school teacher Jana Elliott, was inspired by that phrase after a trip to Israel. She just knew right away, man, that's really what we need to do on the reservation. When tragedy struck in 2016, I miss my mom every day. I wish she was here. Out of heartbreak came hope and action. We really started as a family to just discuss what we wanted to do and and to carry on her legacy. Jenna's passing sparked the creation of Takun Alam, a movement dedicated to repairing the world, starting in Wolf Point and continuing her mission of selfless love. It's the small acts of kindness. It's taking your time at the end of the day to make sure someone's got a ride, someone's got dinner. The organization focuses on community needs by bringing in teachers and youth professionals to the Wolf Point area. <laughs> including an educator from Denver with a heart for outreach. I could work as a teacher still, but also have an aspect of doing ministry and being able to interact more with the families again. She's now running a daycare through Takuna Lum after seeing a need for more child care. Not make sure that they're getting three meals a day and that they've got someone who's trying to teach them to, to read and to know their ABCs. The organization secures housing for recruits so they're able to dig into community issues, planting seeds of change that blossom into ideas like weekend snack bags for students or sanitary kits for kids. And they're just living their life engaged with the people around them and every day trying to take an opportunity to, to share that love. Takun Alam partners with the tribe's youth council to host turkey dinners and chili cook-offs while spreading their mission to help others in small gestures and we had one gentleman come in and he didn't even have shoes on. That make all the difference. So we were able to get him a pair of shoes, get him a couple of pairs of warm socks, and you know, that changed his day, changed his week. She says it's acts like these that carry on the legacy of her mother's love for her students and the Wolf Point community. I just can see her smile and, and see how excited she'd be to do that. In Great Falls, Keely Van Middendorp, MTN News.